So there it is, the good for nothing dunny from Kid Robot in 64 colors. Um, tell you what, it's good for something. It's good for my eyes and good for my collection. What is going on everybody? John Spanky Stokes here with another video review of an awesome new designer toy. And as you can see, this one's good for nothing, pretty much. Very, very excited about this. It is the return of 64 colors to Kid Robot. So we saw basically the box art at New York Toy Fair earlier this year uh, from Kid Robot, but we had not seen turnarounds or spec art or anything, so we had no idea what this was going to look like. And just a couple days ago, they showed what it looks like, and it looked amazing in the photos. And I cannot wait to dig into this right now. So, has a little tab. Let's say, cut that. There we go. Let's open this up. So, there are two colorways of this. Um, so, let me, let's, let, me, uh, let me let me back up. Let me back up again. Is. Oh my goodness, look at how wonderful that figure is. So 64 Colors is a husband and wife team, Eric and Laura. Uh, I've met Eric before at San Diego Comic Con many, many moons ago. Um, never met Laura in person, but, uh, if Laura is anything like Eric, they are both really cool people, because Eric was rad, um, very, very kind, and, um, just talented, as well as Laura, who is the painter, and Eric comes up with a lot of the concepts and whatnot. Um, very, very talented team, and uh, this is the return of what they are known for with their dunny. It's like it's just magical, right? So, I think it was in 2011, I could be wrong, was the first time we actually saw them on the dunny platform um, as a three inch. And that was Dunny Series 2011, if my memory serves me. And then um, we saw the Super Magical 8-inch Dunny the following year, 2012. Um, this one is the Good For Nothing 8-inch Dunny. It is releasing... Well, it, it's releasing this Friday, but I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to get this video posted in time because I have my daughter's birthday like Thursday we're going to Disneyland and um, Friday I'm gonna be Disneyland hungover <laughs> and then Saturday is her birthday party so I'm not sure if I'm gonna get this out but if it's up already but not posted then there still may be some available either at kidrobot.com or at other retailers. Kid Robot has a exclusive colorway. This is the OG good for nothing. It's the red and um, blue and yellow. Kid Robot has a really cool, oh I'm sorry this is limited to 800 pieces and then Kid Robot has an exclusive vintage red and blue um, design that's really really cool looking as well 
Um, and they're both 75 bucks. And that one, the Kid Robot one, is limited to 200 pieces. So maybe we can get a closer look at this. See if we can't admire not only the design, but the QC as well. Like, look at the, the paint app for that. It's got like, you know, spot varnish, spot dull, spot gloss. It's got the little bird. Look at the galaxy. Check out the ears. I mean, every, like, the body. Every single thing is covered. Yep, 64 colors. Uh, I don't know what is that. Is he underwater now? Those bubbles. S sleeping tree. Like, good for nothing. So cool. So these the, the six four colors are known for like their kind of surrealist, magical kind of daydreamy character designs and, and painterly aspects that they do and this thing is just I am floored by how cool this is and I'm sh I don't know if you guys can see but it's like has a really cool metallic sheen to it the paint is really cool I mean this is this is just some very very cool work one of the cooler 8 inch dummies that I have seen in a long time that thing is wonderful. So there it is. The good for nothing Dunny from Kid Robot in 64 colors. Um, tell you what, it's good for something. It's good for my eyes. And good for my collection. Because this thing is a boss. Pick one up, guys, if it's not already sold out. Highly, highly recommended. 75 bucks kidrobot.com or your local designer toy retail location please if you haven't already like subscribe leave a comment down below tell me what you guys want to see what you like if you like these videos uh, if you don't like them sure tell me I can take constructive criticism just don't be mean don't be a bully don't be an online troll because nobody likes trolls um, but like always, until next time, peace and hair grease.